Nice. Here we go, folks. I do like this game. I do like this game a lot. So we want to do a a full run, a proper run now. I need to make it through to uh I need to go to the to the, the I know I can't say because it's spoilers, but I need to go somewhere now. After the final boss. So I'm gonna play as play as well as I possibly can. And we'll see what that gets me. Gotta get those pistol reloads down. Gold. Much like Noita, gold disappears in this game, so you gotta be quick about it. And do we have any more bad guys or is that it? That's it? But there was something else in here. That might be it. Acumatic Carbine, high caliber payload rounds, critical hit. Oh, it'll do, I guess. It'll do. It's not a bad weapon. It was, in fact, a really good weapon. I'm still trying to work out if there's a benefit to picking up uh, or to activating those sources of, of uh, the, the suit signals. It's a dead player. They died somehow and they either become corrupted or you fight what killed them uh, or worse than, than what killed them. So I'm still trying to work that out. I don't think it's worth it. Because nine times out of ten, you lose a shitload of health. That's a bad thing. Spoiled 
resin. We will not be taking that. What do we got here? Wound Seekers. Deal 30% more damage to low health targets. That sounds pretty good. That sounds very good, in fact. Wow. It's got Tracker Swarm on it too. Eh, not worth. This isn't, this isn't a learning, we, we're not here to unlock skills at the moment. We're here to win this run. That's a decent weapon though. If I didn't pick up this one earlier, I'd definitely be grabbing that. Come on, stick your head out. We can track enemies now because our adrenaline level is higher. I hate these guys so much. the green stuff quickly while avoiding getting hit hopefully this room is not going to get us hit I think it's just a shop extra gold if we want to risk getting malfunctions Let's go back and get that other upgrade. These statues here, by the way, they come in all sorts of different shapes and sizes. If you see them with glowing eyes, it means that they hold money and you can destroy them to collect that cash. harmonizer for that. Where was that upgrade? Previous room? That's my pistol. That's back at the start. What the hell? Did we find that? Oh, yeah, straight through there. There we go. Oh, I need 175? God damn it. All right. And I'm tempted to buy another item for 12 ether as well from the start location, just in case it's one that we haven't picked up before. 
pretty smart thing to do. Finally unlock all of them, hopefully. I do have a key. Parasite. Damn it. Increases speed and weapon damage by 25% for the next 15 kills. Detaches afterwards. So it's a guaranteed detach. Eats away a large amount of proficiency on detach. The fuck? Shit. I've got a shield, which is good. Well, I had one at least. secret areas like this. So I'm going to have to go through to the ice zone this time as much as I do not want to do that zone. Um, it's kind of necessary. Night castle, uh, night cast rather, this is Returnal. It's a PlayStation 5 exclusive, much to the annoyance of many. Feels like a fight. Fuck, I bet you it is. Big fucking surprise. Ah, oh, it's a shit too. Nelly dead already. Christ. Wonder if I could have just escaped there. have a look through the door at least. Run in. Quickly. Grab an ether. Grab one of them. Grab another ether. Grab another ether. I'm dead. Not dead. You get a bunch of ether though. Fuck. That was brutal. And I, I always want to collect as much as possible. I wonder if it's possible to collect everything in there. I bet you it's not. Oh shit. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna backtrack a little bit here. Next hit kills me, so. I rest in my ship? Is that a thing anymore? I know they nerfed that. Did they remove it? Let's have a look. No translocators active? What the fuck are you talking about? No translocators active. How about the beginning? Oh, this is my earliest one. Okay. We 
Let's see if it lets me rest. Like we're still fucked. Oh, we got a little tiny, tiny bit back. Wow. So generous. New item unlocked. Adrenaline enhancer. Take one additional hit before adrenaline level drops. Fucking dope. Great item. Alright, so now I'm going to have to pick up some health. Um... Because I can't do another fight like that. That was god awful. Wow, the tiniest smidgen of health. You weren't kidding, huh? Earn salvage from the next three kills, detaches afterwards. God. Yeah, as soon as I saw that saw that fight, I knew what was gonna what was coming. All right, the health we left was there. So the reason I don't necessarily want to pick up health, did I go the right way? I did not. Is because health can be used to increase your maximum health if you pick up three regular heals while at full capacity. Um, now ordinarily I would try to get a little bit clever, a little bit greedy, but I found that collecting them as you go is actually a better way to go. But the trick is not taking damage. Taking damage has a pretty serious impact on the game. Ah, that's the exit there to this thing. Oh, there's one on that side as well. I just fucked up on all accounts. Sub-Zero Pulse certainly won't go astray, hopefully. Gotta take it. Fuck, what a waste. Oh, and there's ledge grabs as well. That's what I was looking for. I missed the, I missed all of that. One more in here somewhere. Small repair. Small repair. I'm going to leave them both. I'm going to use them for max HP. Hopefully I don't regret that decision. Another Aether. We're down to one again. How many items do I have? Can we, can we see that? Wrong button. How many items can I see what there is left to unlock? Databank? Equipment? That's weapons. I think that's all of them. Artifacts. Hmm. 
Nope. One, two, three remaining. Okay. So hopefully it guarantees a new one every time. It may not when you get one near the spacecraft. as much ether as possible. That's your sort of meta currency or one of the meta currencies in the game. Oh, please give me another fight. I dare you. Fuck's sake. Creepy house that's no longer a house. Wonder if there's another way in there. Wonder if I can make that jump. No way. this far. Got 400 bucks. Um, don't need to fight the boss. I would like to do that. Alright, this there's, there's our blade enhancer. Uh, we got a heal as well. What do we got? Gaining or fixing malfunctions increases max integrity. Mm. Where's my spaceman? <laughs> I'd kind of prefer that. Fixing malfunctions. Kind of tempting to get. Uh, let's get back to where was that? I think it was in that room? Yeah, pretty sure. Not that one. That one. Or that one. How much was it? 275. the blade balancer was worth it.
Where the fuck was it, dude? Uh, what? I know there's one in here. I'm looking for the yellow wall. Yellow wall, like the energy wall. We can now break those. Right this way. There it is. It's cash. Fifty nine bucks to be exact. All right, which way are we going now? Break right. In about an hour, James Webb Telescope will be shot into space. I'm not sure what that is. I haven't been keeping up with uh, the latest NASA news or, or whoever's launching that. I'm not going to fight the boss. Eh. Yeah. Fuck. Not good. That's going to be a lockdown for sure. I ain't ready for that. heal. Oh, wait. What are all these rooms I've never seen before? Damage augment, three hundo. And why is this one so foggy? Because of all the alien sacks. It's because of all the alien sacks, isn't it? Fifty percent chance to find better salvage from hostels. Drops obelites disappear one second faster. Like that.
How the fuck did you get up there? Oh, I jumped. Okay, I'll relax. You did it. NASA, ESA, and Canadian Space Agency. 100 times stronger than Hubble. Hm. I don't mind the old space launch. Gets me a little bit excited, you know? If I get a weapon with leech rounds on it this time, do not let me drop it for anything except something better with leech rounds on it. Integrity reduced melee cooldown by 60%. I guess now counts, huh? Shit. Why am I so greedy? I have to use my heal. Ah, even bigger waste. We have 300? Not yet. 245, though. Here's a chest that requires a key. It's good. Very good. Seems pretty, pretty stacked. Chamber. Uh, 
Get me up there. was one other direction we didn't take yet. Ah, it's over here. Yeah, yeah. Danger room. Had a, a Healy beacon in it, which sucks because it heals the enemy, not us. And, uh... Yeah, all around not a good time. Protection by 10%. Protection or damage? I still think damage is probably the way to go. Stuff can't hit you if it's dead, right? Where was that weapon damage increase? Often, if it was off by itself, that could be it there. That's where we are now, or were. All right, let's just fucking do this room. Got it. All right, what are we dealing with? Lockdown lifted. That's it? Okay, that wasn't too bad. Now we get the Healy bed. All right, well. Should have gone this way earlier. God damn it. But I might not have survived, so it's fine. Wait, was that parasite in there? What have we got? Fixes or prevents one malfunction, detaches afterwards. Upcoming malfunctions have more severe effects. Fixes or prevents. All right. We are going to, uh, to get one. I don't know what I want to pick up, but... More gold? Might not be a bad idea. Yep, it's gone. I wonder if the other effect remains. Oh well. Get out, get out, get out, get out.
Okay, so we've got a single heal so far in here. Two we've left behind. Five hundred and twelve, we can get the damage and the protection now. Such a tiny heal I need. Sure is a fine weapon. Moderate heal. Fuck. Um. Nah, leave him behind. Leave him behind. Are we doing a full, full clear here? I'm not sure that's a good idea. Not the boss. I'm not going to do the boss. Another one. <clears throat> so much healing. It's like five, five or six. Plus the healy bed. Mellow, mellow Durixum. No sweat. I can take care of that for you. Thank you very much for supporting the stream with your channel points.
Right on, dude. Welcome. So we might as well take that. Took damage. Uh, that one I don't want. I'm just gonna do this now. Nah, I can I can do the challenge room first. It'll be such a waste otherwise. with yeah it is okay nice although I think it's unlikely we're going to be finding a better weapon than we currently have Fuck me up here. Did take a bit of a bit of a battering there. It's another damage augment. Oh shit! It is too. Let's get two then. So there's that one. I can't remember where the other one was. I'm going to go to Healy Bed now. That probably won't even fully heal us, which really pisses me off. Where was the other damage hog? Where were you? Not that. That's the that's the protection augment. Uh, oh, we haven't been in there either. That's the bed. Uh, let's go do that while we're at it.
Wait, I think it's the bed. Maybe. Healy bed. Did not fully heal. Okay. Oh, cool, man. Let's go through that room over there as well. It's all about, about health management in this game. 90% of stuff is secondary. Secondary to your health maintenance. Got it. It is a, it is a bed. What do you want me to say? Alright, I need a medium... I need a medium. So. There's actually a heal up there as well. What is that? Another small. Another small. So we've got like six or seven at this point. I almost have to backtrack the whole game here. Frustrating. And not all of them are good good heals either. Think think that one at the end, maybe? Hmm, maybe. Let's try over here. This is the protection augment. Nope, that's the one we already got. Yeah. Something tells me this isn't it, but it's worth a look. Ah, it was that one. He would take that too. I thought I got that already. Akiko, happy Christmas to you too, dude. Just venture through. What did it say? Uh, oh, the, the artifact we just picked up at low health. Um, sorry, when the enemy's at 30% health, it's increased damage. Kind of like uh, not an instant kill guillotine. Was it in here? Maybe. Nope. That's always a waste. I don't know why I keep fucking... Shit. Keep going in there. That's too good to go. 
I want to pick up the medium ones first. That would be better. That actually looks like the room that we had to fight in, which might be it. Sacro, same to you. No, there's two baby ones. I didn't go downstairs in that one either. Challenge room's right here, dude. Oh, fuck. Fractal Nail grants 10% weapon damage while you have a malfunction. Proficiency rate by 15%. Chance to retain or consume upon use. No, we're going to take that. I know it's 200 bucks and I know we're saving for the other weapon damage. This is better. Christmas from the other part of the globe. Letalis Umbra. Thank you so much. Uh, it is Christmas where I am as well. Yes. Yes, we are in in the, the firm grasp of the 25th. Ah. Proficiency rate is far too strong to say no to. No, this is a uh, console exclusive. PS, PS4, PS5. on health now? No, let's wait. Let's wait. Fuck off. Be brutal. Oh shit. That's a tough one. That is a tough one. Oh, hi, welcome. This was a party for 20, not 21. I don't know why he joined the joined in the fun, but there we go. Fuck. Oh, I love starting over. That's right, this this run, this is the run.
That was a really good run too. I dislike this weapon. I'm not getting any gold for this shit. Is there anything break it can break through the shields? Um, I think you need a very specific weapon or special ability. The mel like you can you can stab through them. There's a couple of special abilities that can do it. Um, one of them, uh, funnily enough, is called Shield Breaker. No way can I afford anything here. That's a damn shame too. Fuck you. Best upgrade in the game. <laughs> okay, cool. No no no, you your your blade will get through them no matter what. You always have the blade, but obviously that comes with certain risks max integrity upgrades hmm. I don't know if this game's kind of like Isaac, where if you see an upgrade once, you can't see it again. Um, certainly hope not. But that's a really rare one to begin with, so... What did it do? The 500? So instead of three health upgrades required to uh to increase your integrity max it's two oh. fuck off down a hole sorry that really pissed me off then I I dodged in time I know I did clearly I didn't
Good rooms, man. Pound, thank you so much, dude. Um, you're, you're muted. You have me muted? I will write to you. <laughs> yeah, these are a couple of really tough rooms to get. This isn't too bad. trying to get a good start here. Come on. Come on, Celine. You got this. Maybe, maybe. I don't know. Maybe you got this. <laughs> maybe, maybe you don't got it. These guys are so annoying too. If I can get 12 ether as well, I'll probably, um, probably go for the unlock at the start too. It's expensive, but I need to get a, like three or four more, so. I'd love to keep the firearm, the, the sidearm with me as a backup. That'd be a really cool idea too. You can get really powerful pistols, but... Compared to some of the other shit? Come on. Some kind of mine launcher or something. Replicating hits unlocked. Cool, I'm dropping this piece of shit now. Well, let's check to see what replicating hits does first. Easy to use. Kills reward extra proficiency. Oh. Successful hits shoot off extra homing rockets. Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah, we'll try.
low low health increase actually I was gonna wait or at least not get not even get that maybe but with this weapon for now we'll take it See how good this homing rocket business is, huh? Uh. Seems all right. Can't get over how smooth it runs. Yeah, it's it's really well made. I mean it's it's designed to run on PS5 hardware, I guess. Doubles Obelite collection radius suffer damage when picking up items. Bender, same. Tied game of the year for me. Reduces alt fire cooldown by three seconds. Eh, not necessary with this weapon. Yeah, suffering damage in any capacity is not good in this game. Slows down time when looking down the sights. So we won't be using that a lot with this weapon, but slows down time is quite good anyway. Didn't die. I could have maybe got another. <laughs> no. I'm happy with that pickup. New weapon. Nah. Last biome is brutal. They've made it tougher. Um, significantly tougher as well. Not just... Not just a little. Like, I get fucked up. And now I have to beat the boss to get the true ending. Hopefully we do that tonight.
Okay. I don't know if a hurt yourself build exists in this one that takes advantage of... Well, I mean, low health, yes, but to be permanently at low health doesn't seem like it's worth it. Like, that seems like a bad thing. See, this room never used to spawn enemies. It probably will now. Maybe... That's amazing. Every time we pick up a resin now, we get protected. We get a one hit extra shield. Anything else in here worth going up top here? That's tough. Double shielded turrets. That's that's really tough. Oh fuck. Nullification sphere. Hello. We can cheese that a little bit. We can get two malfunctions and then remove them instantly. Probably do a reasonable clear first before getting that though. What are malfunctions? So you see... Hmm, you know the purple... Items around. Except... Except ether. It's a little bit confusing. Ether sparkles with like golden flecks so they they that's just like a consumable right that's your meta currency let's see if i can find let's see if i can find something be like a cursed item deal kind of you have a chance to um you have a chance to get uh a malfunction and a malfunction is like a debuff that you can remove as long as you fulfill the re requirements, right? Some are much, much harder, some are easy. Um, yeah. This here is like a broken... Actually, look, check it out. This is a waste, but I'm going to go... There you go. So we got to kill 15 hostiles and our map is scrambled. Actually, not a bad one. And that one we got for free. I'm not going to use it yet because we're going to fill... Kill 15 hostiles easy. Getting around might be a little tough. So this can be um, a consumable. The blue things we want. The orange things we don't.
Fuck is that? Obelite stabilizer drops obelites last three seconds longer. Sick. That only costs 75. I don't normally go for more than one, and it's a bad scramble too, like looking at the map. You can kind of make out where you need to go. Kind of. Like this is uh, one path. We got a locked door through there, which is going to be a waste. That was the room we checked out just a second ago. Here we have the creepy house. Well, former creepy house. Creepy Ruins, formerly known as Creepy House. Honestly, I would recommend buying a PS5 just for this. But I'm a bit of a, a nut when it comes to this sort of thing. Um, although, getting Demon Souls as well. Yeah, that's a that's a win-win. Living room covered in wrapping paper. How's the run? It's uh, it's going well, dude. Well, the first one was shit, and then the the follow up one to that was shit, and the third one as well. That was that was shit. But this one's going pretty well so far. Fight room. Can I just leave? I'm gonna try. Yep. Fuck that. No thank you. No thank you. Woo. That is a spicy meatball. I don't even know if it's worth fighting that. Like, what's he going to drop? A couple of consumables? Fuck you. It is a very difficult game, yes, yep. Like even on my best runs, a single room can turn around and just say, you know what? Fuck. And then other times you get weapons like that. Not the strongest, but boy oh boy, it'll do the job. What's with the minimap? Ah, uh, check, check out the top left, that's a malfunction. game said it was going to be upgraded weapons from here on out. Right, so that for each run, that's your level. Weapon, Your weapons are tied directly to your proficiency level. Ours happens to be 17 at the moment. Every time we level up, that's gonna, that's gonna, we're gonna get better drops, essentially. We got Eminis in here. No Eminis? I still don't trust you. Still don't trust you. Fuck, I love that thing. It's so cool. Oh my god! Oh 
That's that's two of my three favorite weapons on the screen at the same time. What's in large chamber? Overheat limit increased. You can fire for longer without reloading. Increases tethered damage when hostiles are at low health. A blight extractor. Eh. Honestly, the other one has portal beam two on it. That's that's a that's a showstopper right there. It's so good. Oh, okay. New room. Love what you've done with the place. You dick. Fabrication cost reduced by 15%. Dropped obelites disappear one second faster. That's a 15% discount, and we're still per plus two seconds on that one. Fixes or prevents one, one malfunction, reduces pr protection by 10%. If I picked it up now... Seems like a waste. Uh, might as well. Allows a consumable to be... Reused triggers a critical malfunction on detach. No. This... Yeah, let's get it. So we get our map back. Yeah, this, this weapon is ridiculous. I didn't even check what the, uh... Marwal, thank you so much for the raid. Marwal the Narwhal. Give me a second so I can properly thank you. Get me the fuck out of this corner, please. Got my shield back. Dead now, motherfucker. Ah, uh, Marwal, thank you so much. Swinningen. Swingden. Marwal Swingden. Orange just means it's a it's a extra couple of levels above. I'll explain a dreadbound in a sec. It's 
Nah. It's okay. How's the run? This one's going pretty pretty well. This one is pretty well. Thank you very much for the raid. How was your stream? Um, so this weapon, you'll notice it doesn't have a recharge rate. It fires three projectiles and they return. Or up to three, so I can fire a single and it'll come back, right? The closer you are to a wall or a target, um, this one has a really fast return, so it's almost worth getting. But some of them are pretty slow. I'm gonna I'm gonna stick with the portal portal gun though. It's too good, too good, too good. Cleared Sphinx and the cursed mummy, thanks to someone much more knowledgeable. Sorry, Sphinx and the Cursed Mummy. I, I don't know what that is. I've never heard of it. New game? Old game? What a split stream do it's not that good. Fires an additional stream of homing shards. And we need to learn it anyway. Stability's much higher. Uh vertical barrage I prefer. Kind of all recently re-released. Third person adventure game like Zelda. Oh no way! Sphinx and the Cursed Mummy. Oh, I've seen the box art before. Oh, it kind of reminds me of uh, Sands of Time. It's probably more fun than Sands of Time. I mean, fun is in like lighthearted, maybe, M maybe not. I've definitely seen the box art. So the alt fire on this gun is um, that, which is pretty great. Stability is rock solid. Don't give up portal beam. Nah, and this, this is not the run. This is not the run to give that up. Ugh. Yeah, the numbers, the, the level doesn't really mean a lot. Like, I've had a level 15 virtually endgame weapon before. Um, it's just the, the increased... Um, the modifiers have been increased. So, talking about the level of each of the, the bonuses. Excuse me. So we've got our challenge room in here. I'm concerned after that last one, if I'm being honest. I don't mind the the drones in this level. The drones in the next level, fucking worst. But the ones in this level are fine. Uh, the ones I hate are those flying motherfuckers. The the winged ones. Didn't it? Increases protection by 15%. Greatly increases melee cooldown and dash cooldown. Go fuck yourself. 
What a waste of a key. There is... Suffer damage when collecting items. Ugh. <laughs> There's another chest in here just like that. Uh, where was that? In the little alcove bit, yeah? There. Sylphon vial, nice! Okay, so that's a heal. Reduced max integrity. That better be fucking temporary. If I get... Fuck you. Thanks for nothing. Well, now we're doing the challenge room. That's done that. Fuck. Okay then. Literal worst. Such a douche. Such a douche. I fucking... And here we go again. Why is it giving me two waves at once? I don't understand. Maybe they've just straight up made it harder. Maybe that's maybe that's it. Pristine calibrator level nine. Ten percent protection while alt fire is recharging. Sick. Bit of cash. Damage siphon is pretty nice. Ah. And I use my heal on that too. Attaching or detaching parasites repairs integrity. Oh, might as well. I can afford it. What do we got at the moment? Fabrication cost reduce. Ah. Survivor killing blow detaches afterwards. Critical triggers a critical malfunction on detach. Yeah, we'll take that. Critical malfunction means you lose one of your um one of your your artifacts. Can be pretty tough, but you're still in the fight, so. That's something, I guess.
Alright, now go through there. Did we find the, the bed already? We did, right? I don't know, we've had like four runs now at this point. What you got? Protection augment? Damage augment? Proficiency rate augment? Even better. So we haven't been to the shop yet, and we've got to go to the boss room anyway. That's the... Wait, it's already open? Did I just walk away from that? Okay, well, we'll head back there real quick. One sec. How are the bosses in this? I didn't want to fight the boss on this run, but since you asked... <laughs> um, pretty fucking amazing. They're bullet hell-ish. Did we go to the shop? It's right there. Have I played Risk of Rain 2? Yeah. You got about 60 hours in Risk of Rain. It sounds like such a low, low number, doesn't it? 60 hours. Just the 60. I've got my 12 as well. I should probably go back. What do we got? Oh, spaceman. Fabricate. Gaining or fixing malfunctions repairs integrity. At low integrity suit auto repairs. So that is insanely good. We are going to save for it. Um, could check out the boss shop real quick too. Oh, is he coming down for me? Oh, that'd be great if you did. these dudes spawning here. It's interesting. Come on. There may not be a shop in here.
Uh, I definitely want that um, that upgrade before we fight the boss, though. The low integrity one. 100%. How much do I need for that? We got 280. Was that like 350? It's not cheap. I like Rex. Uh, who else did I find good the huntress very um very weak can't take many hits which is a, a huge problem obviously Wait, is Rex the one that deals self-damage to, to heal or self-damage to damage enemies and then you have to heal with a different one? Maybe it's not Rex I'm thinking of if that's the case. That is Rex. Uh, okay, yeah, then maybe maybe not that not that one. The captain was kind of fun. Um, I saw a heal somewhere. Where was that? shouldn't be fighting him. Alright, I was going to get that upgrade first, right? 306, is that enough? That's what I thought. Where the fuck was it? That was the shop, the main shop. Oh, we still haven't gone that way either. I need 28 more bucks. Fuck. Me. What a weapon. Well. I'm 
Void Beam is a... Kind of like a... Uh, what do you call it? A railgun kind of kind of shot. That's not what I was looking at. It's the leech rounds too. Which means we get health back when killing enemies. It's as good as you think. That is an end game weapon. And was it armor piercing as well? Was I that lucky? I'll pick it up in a sec. Armor piercing and rising pitch. <laughs> okay. That's, that doesn't get much better, to be honest. That's one of the best weapons I've seen in the game. Mm -mm. No, I still want the low... I still want the, uh... Wait, what was that? Protection, 170. Ah. I got the Spaceman too, right? We can get both, you sure? How much was the other? I forgot. What do we got? 407? 411? No way. 306 and we needed 28. Then we can't get both. And that's okay. It's, it's all good. We've still got more to explore here as well. Pretty cool. I don't believe I've seen this room either. Holy shit. So you got a focus fire here. Um... Run and hide tactics don't work as well with this weapon. over half my health gone just to get one I think I might pass on that Let's look at armor piercing. Projectiles will pierce hostiles and ricochet off surfaces. Rising pitch versus increases protection. 
High caliber. The expensive fire rate and leech rounds. The other one would be better for healing. This one has so much more damage though. So fire rate is a big helper when it comes to, um, oh shit, but yeah, two shots and you're dead. Fire rate's a big help when it comes to, um, leech rounds. We lose out on that, but it's going to hit like a fucking truck. Good shot. Ah. We can absolutely afford both now, I think. I missed the door? I missed the door. We'll go back. Uh, 340 and 170. So we're almost. shop and then we'll go in here and get uh, I think it was that one right next to the shop wasn't it and any left over at the end of the run will get protection I guess I should actually should probably consider getting that instead Nah, we'd be fine. Fine, Quave, don't worry about it. Wait, that is protection. I'd say with the amount we're earning plus the discount, I think we'll be okay. Ah. Big levels, huh? No wonder runs used to take me like four or five hours.
Uh, we can't take down shields with this. It's weird. Sometimes you can. I don't know if it's a damage threshold or what. Did I just get hit there? I think I might have. threshold rather than damage maybe maybe except if you're using one of those specific items like your sword or shield breaker alt fire I've seen a waterfall in here either. get wrecked twenty five dread bound nice we got in here this is damage yeah right 255 for that we're unlikely to get that I would say that's all right I'm okay without it well, we'll see. Next level's the test. Um, Alright, just because you asked, we're going to do the boss too. I think we'll be okay now. See if I can not fuck it up. Oh, hold on. There's one more thing that I want. Which I don't think I got. Right at the very start... I've been collecting all this uh, ether. Unless I bought it already, but I'm pretty sure I didn't. Wrong way. Wait, what? Oh, it's through another room. My bad. I was going the right way. Sometimes it's connected directly to this room. New item. I've only got a couple left. Personal item. Improved chances of fighting salvages from a hostel. Salvage from hostels. A charred piano key. Yes, that makes total sense. So we have two revives. One of them will drop an item. Um, have a small heal with me. Oh, it was the big heal, which is 175. We get 30 more. 
Mm. Um, a lot of people consider it their game of the year. I'm included in that list. Or one of, shared with Inception and, uh... And Echoes of the Eye, the DLC for Outer Wilds. Oh, it's it, the yeah. It does actually make sense in kind of the context of the story. It doesn't make sense logically, even associated with the story. But yeah, it's like part of Celine's past. One fifty-one. Mm. All right, I'm going to shut up.
Oh yeah, Leech kept us pretty topped up there. Adrenaline enhanced to take one additional hit before adrenaline levels drop. Love it. That's like three extra hits now we have. Um, it's not what I wanted though. I really wanted one of those uh, cryptosphere things, whatever they're called, the the orbs. This thing, data cube. Um, that's about it. I don't think there's much else to do here. We didn't earn any cash from that. So we didn't use the bed yet, did we? Or or did we? Shit, I might have. Let's see if we can find that. Uh... Next area sucks. It's fucking hard. Really hard. Every, everything's harder now. Like. Well, one, I, I'm still still relearning the game, but it's been tweaked a lot. I I first cycled every boss in the game last time I played. Um, <laughs> uh, Frank took me out. He's the first boss uh, just recently. So, yeah, they've made it a lot harder. I only need five bucks, man. Come on. Was it here? Yes. Cool, we get a full heal before we leave. Like the last zone? Unreal. Like the last zone is ridiculous. Ridiculously hard. Got, I got my money. Maybe we should keep it though. That buys me a large heal. I'm gonna need it for some of those challenge rooms next next floor. Fuck. I'm gonna need it. Yeah, Hyperion's by far and away my favorite boss. Um, like it's not even not even close. The final boss in the first world is yeah, he's or in the third world rather. It's pretty good. I used to dislike it because it's pretty simple. It just kind of like teleports around the room and stuff, but that's alright. Where am I going? Shop. Shop. Axe integrity we don't need. Um... That's it. Let's go. Have I played Fist? Do you mean Fits? Fights in tight spaces? If the question is that, then yes, I have. Like it a lot, actually. Very good game. I just started, um, actually if, if you type in Queebvent, exclamation mark Queebvent, there's a little calendar of, uh, Great Metroidvania. No, we're, diff we're thinking of a different game then. 
This one's a, a card-based strategy battler. Two small heels, a big heel. Alright, that's good. First in Shadow Torch? What? Forged in Shadow Torch. F-I-S-T. Well, that's cute. Looks great. 15% off at the moment. I'll add it to my list. Merry Queebmas to you, friend. How you doing today? Blade Balancer, Execution Blast, bleh. Nah. Blasphemous. There's a game I haven't played in, like, a million years. Well, when it first came out. Um, I'll worry about that later. That's cool. I love, I especially love the part where the beams appeared out of nowhere. Well, now I'm going in here. Execution bolts. Cleanse it. Emergency proficiency. Gain 25% proficiency rate at low integrity. Uh, now we're going to use leech rounds to heal. Another dash disabled. Um, excuse me, I kinda need dash to get that, unless I can run through here. Interesting, what's that? Oh! <gasps> Scout log. While crossing the desert, I used to feel the shadows watching me. Could they have been manipulating me instead? Not passive watchers. Challenger. Am I being manipulated now? If that's the case, why do I feel like I wanted to continue? Okay, that works. I like that. Do I want to do the challenge room now? Fuck this room. This is fucked already. I need to take out the turrets.
No. Up, bud. That's what I thought. Yep. Dinner chicken. The gun's keeping me alive. Absolutely. Yep. What we got? What is? Oh, I just I just picked it up. I don't know what I what I bought. But I bought it. Recharge response. Getting hit reduces alt fire cooldown by five seconds. Yeah, I wouldn't have spent money on that. Ah, uh, that ain't even the hardest thing done. What's the what's the second boss? Oh, it's the the big chicken, right? I think it's the big chicken. another corridor I always get hit in because I am garbage at dodging traps of all description not so garbage today well fuck
Whoop. Okay, cool. Fuck you. Wow. Getting fucking wrecked here. Two, two of them's a bit rough. Fucking hell. Okay. I see you, fam. Not a good fight. The worst. I wasn't kidding. I said this zone was fucked. See, I don't think I can get near that. Just bounces off the shield. hit really hard though, doesn't it? Come on. Come on. Gotta be more in here. Like dozens and dozens and dozens more. Pretty nice. Don't let go of leech rounds. You will regret. That's so many. Oh shit. Looks like it's retreat o'clock. Get that turret. I never did get that. Ah, oh, fuck. Got 
traps too. Oh, it's you. Rude. Can that hurt me? Shit, probably can. Marwell, no sweat. Take it easy. Thanks for the raid again, dude. I don't even have to do this zone. That's the funny part. We could skip it. I just want to be as well prepared for the third zone as possible. A chance at finding a better weapon. However slim, I think we should probably take as well. Ooh. Oh, Jesus. Look at him. Just waiting. I really think they did nerf their uh, their explosion dive. That only happens every every very rarely now. Undying, happy Christmas to you, dude. Hope you're doing well. That must be all of them, yeah. I'm barely healing here. Barely. These are what we want right here. Only back a ton of cash. That is definitely good news, though. <sighs> oh, 
I've never seen this room before either. Where are we going? Huh. Nice little trip. For that though? I don't believe it. Why? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Greatly increases max integrity, reduces melee damage by 50%. Yep. Don't mind if I do. <laughs> right. That's like, that's insane. Um, yeah, that's, that's ridiculous. I can't say, I can't say no to that. Split stream as well. Oh my God. We're going to learn phase two, which is good. Did that just drop? Did that just drop from one of them? I didn't know you could get proficiency from them. Alright, well, do I have a key? I do not have a key. It's a pretty damn good room. Don't leave Lee Trans. I know, I know, trust me, I know. Fuck, here we go. Oh, the worst of the worst, too. Nullification spheres. Full auto. Kind of interested in learning what that is. Sounds really fun. What you got? What? What this? Silver lattice become immune to slowdown effects. Sure. Let's go back to the shop. I don't... I don't think we have to stick around. Is 
There's more protection here. What's this? Max integrity. Anything. Eighty five bucks, yeah. That's two large heels we have. Too large, too small. It's pretty good. We have two extra lives. <laughs> they can go in a heartbeat. Uh, let's have a look at the last section here. No, I'm going to go. I left leech rounds behind, but I've got phasing rounds, portal, split stream. Yeah, we're doing good. We're doing good. Just take it slow. This is portal what? Fires an additional stream of homing shards, phasing rounds, go through stuff surfaces, portal turret, and serrated projectiles cause additional damage over time. Like with the damage and rate of fire, like come on. Oh, that's right. That's how it behaves underwater. You don't get a laser underwater. You get this little machine gun type thing. Oh, shit. What was that? Is that my weapon recharging? Maybe. <laughs> Waves. Waves is average. Uh, and Tendril Pod is probably better here. Disables turrets, which we don't have underwater. Aha, right. Don't go for the chest, go up. Wait. Oh, it's different elevators? No. Wait, 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 hang on. Is there a way up there? I thought. It's one of those timed rooms, right? It went up there. Okay. I'm, I'm learning this one. Fuck. 
and you're just too shy. All right, this way. No. Oh boy. this one fewer kill required alt fire cooldown increased by five seconds no you're gonna lock me in there Shit. these enemies they terrify me stop Big heal. I don't want to go over there. What are you shooting at? to come back that way, maybe. Also inclined to skip any ridiculous rooms as well. <gasps> Another one. 17 of 20. Integra to gain a shield against the next hit. Limit reached. What do you mean limit reached? As in limit reached? Yeah. Okay. Pretty good loadout. I'm getting down to the rough choices area.
This is lore room. I think it is. Pretty sure it is. Yeah. Usually nothing really in there, is there? It's a chest at the back. All right, all right. It's very good. Yes, Sean, yep. Yeah. Mega rocket. Oh, don't. Oh, fuck off. That was unnecessary. I didn't realize there was a void. <laughs> Oh, good. Got another shield anyway. I'm so glad they fixed the audio with the Hollow Seeker. I don't know if you remember, but when the game first came out, at least for me, I don't know, other people didn't experience this, but. Um, Go up there at the start. Um, it, it squelched. It made this horrible fucking noise. It was awful. Like this digital grind. So whack. Jay Fort, thank you so much. Did I revisit Hyperlight Drifter today? No, I didn't. No, that game's probably not for me. Like, not bad, by any stretch of the imagination. Difficulty's way too high, though. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I'll do that too. I now have four resurrects, three, four heals. Why you no pick up? It's lean. Oh, 
I don't even have a key. Swift underwater. Very. Earn salvage from the next three kills detaches afterwards greatly reduces my fuck off. Why parasites gotta be bad? Why can't they be good? What you got? Tell me there was a point to doing that previous room. There was. Okay. Ah, Celine. Never change. Yeah, it's a it's a very Metroid-esque upgrade system. Oh, wow. That's three heals. Five heals we have now. I'm gonna make it. I'm gonna make it. I'm telling you. Who needs leech rounds? Honestly, I do. Successful overloads briefly increase speed and protection by 15%. Don't, don't get too careful. I'm trying. Trust me, I'm, I'm being real careful here. Oh, 
Not even gonna do that. If I don't have to, that is. Oh, this is the way down. So... Down it is. Six heels. Seven heels. There are a lot of baddies down here. Yep. Not much I can do about it either. I think you're locked in there as well. That's new as well, right? That that never used to be the case. trying to tempt me here. They're really trying. Stay strong, Queeb. <laughs> Stay strong. I got three nullification spheres. I should probably be opening some chests, huh? because it's a parasite though. <laughs> no key. What does the signal do? Um, it's another player. I guess I'm in online mode and another player has died in this room and one of two things happen. Um, they become infected um, or possessed or what, what, whatever and um, they turn into like a, a unique baddie themselves or alternatively um, a giant monster will spawn supposedly the thing that killed it but couldn't possibly be appearing in that room in the first place I still haven't worked out if it's beneficial to do I, I call no but I know I could be wrong I didn't actually take damage in that room, I'm actually surprised. At least I don't think I did. Yeah.
any benefit to play on nine this game? Well, that's that's the thing. I don't know if there's like every time I've bought one, like you you get a few like scraps from them, right? But it's very rarely worth it. Um. No, I'll just use it for chests. I think that's the best thing. Never did get that upgrade. Fuck you. Payload high caliber accelerated. Accelerated means it hits its target much faster. Kinetic fields waste. Look at that damage though. Uh, we'll keep what we got. I think we'll be okay. Auto repairs while at lower integrity reduces repair efficiency by 30%. No, no. RN Gamer, what is up, my dude? Happy Christmas to you, friend. Hope you're having a lovely day. Do you have today off or are you working today? Let's evac from here, I think. Let's back up a little bit. I'm doing good, brother. I'm doing real good. Um, they've made this game real hard. In almost every aspect. Straight ahead. Oh, we go straight for the boss. I got, I'm sitting on seven heals right now. I got three revives, like. Did we just go straight for the boss? Reckon I could do it? I don't know, I haven't fought this boss since the latest patches. Uh, looking around for an extra weapon couldn't hurt though, right? Oh, hi.
Yeah, our end plays this as well, right? I'm a member of the Celine fan club. What is even up ahead? Ah, fuck it. Why not? I don't need that. It's not worth the hassle. Let's go fight the boss. That's my goal here. Health, by the way, is looking pretty good. I don't remember this at all. Giant door. Open. Sidearm? Nice. Well, no turning back now. Wakey wakey, eggs and bakey. Oh, he hit me. Celine better not fucking DMCA me. Fair, fair. Oh, I'll take the little the little heal up. Thanks, brother. Hit 
Hit him in the shoulder. This is still way too easy. He's got new moves. He's got new moves. Oh, that's pretty. Look at that. Isn't that glorious? I love it. Still need three, uh, three data cubes, man. Here's the data cube mulcher. Yeah, I expected, uh, like the other bosses have, have been, uh, very, very, uh, it's very easy to see how, how they made them harder. Um, but that one, yeah. So now comes major spoilers. I haven't even seen this myself yet. But I got, I got a different item that I didn't have last time I came through here. Just gotta remember not to fucking miss it, that's all. Can we talk spoilers? Yeah. Ah, here we go. Of course you can't miss it.
I told you to leave me alone. Later, Hikiko. You're the spaceman now, Celine. Nope, 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 nope. Sorry, Celine, trying to get me fucking DMCA'd again. Um, I'm just as confused as I was before. Uh, but that's the that's the true ending. Yeah, unless there's more to do. Can you rant about it? Yeah, go for it. Yeah, this is this is fine. Why was the spaceman walking on the street? Yeah, so to, to do that, you need to collect a key. To get the key, you need to go into the basement of the house. To get in the basement of the house, you need to collect six fragments, one of which I had a very difficult time finding, but the rest I've got just through a normal course of play. The planet is all in Selene's head, trying to cope with her losing her daughter, Helios. We've, we've thought... That was one possibility. The other was that was Celine was dead and kind of stuck in purgatory. They were the two major uh, major theories. It's not very clear though, is it? Did think of the strange that Helios abandoned. Oh yeah, okay. Right, the the astronaut being there, that could have been they could have made that a a person. Alex, no sweat, thank you so much. Hope to see you tonight. Um Oh, I've gone over again, haven't I? Oh no no, it's fine. It's fine. Uh for for Noitimus, the twenty fifth of December. The astronaut is Celine. Well, that's true, right? She took off. We know that. Didn't they make mention of Celine's mother, the person in the wheelchair? Maybe she was the one driving if Celine went into space? It's all very vague. I'd love to sit the 
sit the riders down. Celine crashed into the river. So it's her drowning, and that's why she... Uh, I don't know. The name was... Uh, the, what was the name of the person in the chair? They did give her one just then in that scene. See ya. Hyperion is Selene's father. And they only ever know one song, apparently. Streamers be damned. Hmm. Strange game. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> they're, they're 100%. I, I have zero doubt there's going to be a sequel. This did so well. It's a system seller. That's why Sony picked them up. Works with this music too, this Risk of Rain music. And vaguely open. I mean, I get it, right? So I've seen movies that are like that. Some you enjoy talking about afterwards, but some that are just too vague. And if you talk with someone who has a different opinion, it, it becomes kind of weird. Well, shit, I didn't actually start the recording again. Good on you, Queeb. Well done. QA getting their names in the credits makes me very happy. I I would I would hate to think that they leaned on the it was all a dream situation. Very close to that is she's dead. Um, and then a, a, a very meager third place belongs to um. It's how she's dealing with trauma. I liked it. It's a great game. Great game. I'm still going to go back and hunt for, for more. I just, I want more. Um, I want to, I want to, I'm not interested in daily runs at all. Um, I want to, I want to go one through six in one run. I think that would be awesome. But you'd, you'd be way too powerful. If you make it to the end of the third, you're going to smash four through six, so... I'd love to see different systems as well. Only slight showstopper for one through six is that there's kind of a hard reset when you enter four. Right. I mean, but even still, the first weapon you pick up, it's going to be a level 15 weapon. Um, but yeah, you do it like, what, what do we have? Three, four goes tonight to get a decent run.
Studio IT or Studio It. Chad. There he is again. Can you reset to time before reset to before time progressed? Uh, what what do you mean? You can go back to one to three. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's there's a new function that opens up in the ship. It's like the machine that you find at the end of the third uh you can kill the intro boss intro boss i don't remember that Music reminds you of Risk of Rain. It is Risk of Rain music. <laughs> they fucking, they wanted to DMCA me. <laughs> so I switched him off. <laughs> Black Tentacle Beast Monster. I don't even remember that. Risk of Rain music is like the guile theme right you put that in here it it'd fit i wonder if a, i wonder if a band has actually done this with real instruments It'd be kind of amazing You still wish Risk of Rain 2 would be a 2D pixelated game? Navarin, come on. The third dimension, man, that's where it's at. I'm, I'm glad they evolved it. They've done an incredible job with Risk of Rain 2. the longest fucking credits ever. Consumer Insights Licensing. I think I liked watching watching streamers play the first one more, but I think I like playing number two more than I like playing number one. There's something, there was something very calming about watching powerful looping runs of the first game and the crunchy noise that the enemies made when they slammed their fists together, shit like that. That was, had a charm to it. I think you would need, um, well, you can use keyboard for it. It's built in. I don't think it has full controller support. Two's great, cat template. Two's, two's really good. You're trying out the final station. Didn't I buy that? I can't remember what I bought. Where's my, where's my profile?
You can never see your own oh, fucking steam, dude. Come on. Now you want Steam Guard. Oh my god. No, you don't get Steam Guard. Not today. Just what I purchased. I don't know. I can't remember. I if Final Station um doesn't exactly sound like my kind of game. Like I would like it, but it's a it's one of those ones where it's a survival type one and that crafting and all that. Maybe maybe I'm wrong. We're still going here. This is unreal. Final station is about trains. It's about the train. Lambs. More people go into this than making a, a movie, Jesus. This music's good, huh? It's so weird. This was kind of touted as a, um, you know, a small studio that, that brought this to you. It's like, yeah, and everybody else. It's the little, the little video game that could. Well, that's just it all of these different studios like you don't know what they did right it could be animation it could be art it could be audio like it could be a million different things oh this this has the song don't fear the reaper in it. oh can't see that the story all names characters and incidents portrayed are fictitious Oh. White Shadow. There it is. Gold Trophy.
It's not a no, not a not a true story. No. Um. So that's gonna be it for me. I'm gonna I'm gonna get some sleep before we play Noita all night tomorrow. Well, for a little bit. And then, uh, yeah, let's raid in on someone. Surprise, surprise, not many people are streaming right now. But Hollow is. We're going to raid Hollow. Yeah, tomorrow is, or today, rather, happy Christmas, everybody. Is, uh, is no, n Merry Noitmas. The, have you not, have you not looked at my spreadsheet? It's been on there since day one, by the way. It's filling up, huh? A lot of good games on there. A lot of really good games on there. I'm I'm loving this event. It's I'm exhausted too. I'm really fucking tired, but it's fun. A month of, of 12 hour streams is takes a toll. Folks, I'll see you very soon. Ms. Quib will be uh, kicking off stream. I don't know if we'll start early, probably around 6 again. We'll see how I feel. Um, but until then, take it easy and good night.